No, I would have to use the tape to die. And of course. Oh, hi. My name's Tucker. And I'm just working on this word problem. And I'm going to have to use a tape diagram. But first, let's read the word problem. Farmer Gary has a north field and a south field. He harvested 452 pumpkins from his fields. He collected 132 pumpkins from the north field. How many pumpkins came from his south field? Well, right off the bat, you know that there's two fields. And uh, there's 452 pumpkins in home. So... To write a tape diagram, you would do this. And for the whole number, you would write this. Well, this is how I do it, of course. Four, five, two. Now, there are two fields instead of just one big field. So we would have to divide it into two. Now, it says that there is 132 pumpkins in the north field. But in the south field, he doesn't. But in the south field, we do not know what he has, so we will put a. And now let's work an, up an equation. Okay, so for my from my point of view, I would for to make it a little bit harder, I would put one hundred thirty two plus. A equals 452. Now, to figure that out, we can't just count up to 452. Now, that would be the hard one. You could do that if you want, but I would not recommend it. Now, the way I would do it is by doing this. 452 minus 132 now this is a subtraction of course so to so let's work it 2 minus 2 that equals 0 5 minus 3 that would equal 2 and 4 minus 1 that would equal the old 3 of course now we know that a is 320. So right here, we can put A equals 320. And that is a tape document.